Advice to seniors. First of all, congratulations. You've worked hard and you've graduated from BU. And the whole world is now in front of you. So what advice would I give? To the graduating class of 2019, I want to say, make a difference in the world. Everything that you've learned how to do here at BU, it's now time for you to take that out into the world. Graduation, it's, it's a joyous occasion, but if you're not necessarily feeling joyous, don't worry about it, it's a complicated moment. It's a period of transition. It's okay to feel stress. You're not supposed to have everything figured out in your 20s, uh, and that's okay. Whatever it is that you end up doing, make sure that you're excited about it, that you're passionate, and that every day you get up, wanting to do what it is that you're supposed to be doing. I think that rigid game plans never really work out as well. I think you want to have plans, but you kind of want to be able to go with the flow. You're going to pivot a lot of different times, and that's OK. But it's important just to make a step in any direction and ask for help if you need it. Surround yourself with people who know more than you. Don't be intimidated by that. Embrace that. You may think you have it all planned out. But what I get so excited about is hearing from my students who've gone on to do amazingly great things that they never would have thought possible when they were standing right where you are today. A lot of you are going to graduate. You're going to get that first apartment on your own. And you're going to look around your apartment and say, you know what this is missing? A dog. If I may give you some unpopular advice, don't get a dog right away. My advice is get a good night's sleep every night. Exercise. Never lie. Cherish your family and your friends. Understand what FICO is and how that credit score can influence your life. Live abroad. Learn new languages. Go on adventures. No one ever said on their deathbed, oh, I wish I had done more work. And then finally, I think it's really important to say that when you find a passion in life, you need to figure out how to, how to cultivate that passion and work it into your life. And maybe you're lucky enough to do that for a living, or maybe it's a side hobby. But either way, you want to protect that passion and go after it because it will make your life a richer, fuller um, experience. I haven't always been a college professor. And some of the questions I get sometimes are, why did I go back to academia? And the answer is you. Watching you graduate is so bittersweet because I'm so proud of you. And I'm so sad to lose you. Please keep in touch. Don't forget us. We definitely are not going to forget about you. Congratulations, class of 2019. Congratulations. 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 You've worked hard. You deserve it. We're so proud of you. Just remember how much the world needs you. So get out there and do good things. And don't forget to enjoy this moment.